Hello there. Right, so I've seen a couple of videos about a gene called HLA-B27. And you're probably wondering, well, what is HLA-B27? And why have I seen videos of it? And what's it got to do with me? Basically, HLA-B27 is the name given to the gene that is most commonly associated with ankylosing spondylitis. So, although it's most commonly associated, it's not exclusively linked. So, for example, if there is a um, person who has been tested for HLA-B27 and they're positive for it, it doesn't mean they're guaranteed to get or develop ankylosing spondylitis. And vice versa, if someone's got ankylosing spondylitis, it doesn't mean that they've definitely got the HLA-B27 gene. So, a bit of confusion there. It's not guaranteed, basically, either way. So with that out of the way, you're probably wondering, yeah, but what actually is it? Um, sorry, that's my cat meowing. Um, it is a protein that attaches to um, cells to tell them whether they're harmful, um, like foreign bodies, for example, in your um, blood or, or what have you, or whether they're okay um, within your system. So basically, it goes along, attaches to a whatever it would be, like white blood cell, I think it is for your immune system. And it says, um, hey, Mr. White Blood Cell, I think you're foreign. Therefore, I'm going to attack you with my immune system to get rid of you. Yeah. But it's confused. So the, the protein itself is confused. So sometimes it goes along doodle, 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 and grabs a healthy cell and says, unlucky, I think you're a foreign body, you shouldn't be here, I'm going to attack you. Then what happens is your immune system therefore attacks itself. So imagine that on a massive scale throughout your body, that is um, your immune system that is knackered basically. So that's what HLA-B27 is. The HLA is one thing and the B27 is something else. One's a protein and the, uh, the other is something else. But um, that's how it works, HLA-B27. Oh, and you can pass it on to your children. That's another fact about it. Okay, see you later.